The time for the Rookie Championship Tournament is upon us again. This tournament has produced many promising boxers, and it is said that any boxer who wins the title will most certainly become a world champion. The eastern region of Japan is quite interesting this year. There's Hayami, the interscholastic athletic meet champion, Yoshida, who came in second at the same meet, Mashiba, who fights with a high level of perfection, and Miyata, who's widely viewed as a boxing prodigy. Any one of them will certainly make the future boxing world his stage if he should win the title. My personal attention is with Makina Uchi from the Kamagawa Boxing Gym. He has two wins out of two matches with two KOs. His style as a dynamite puncher fills us with big dreams. His opponent in the first match is Jason Ozma. We should see an exciting clash between his hooks and Makina Uchi's powerful punches. These are the battles among the rookies who aim to reach the top. One of them might wind up to be the champion. No, no, Fuji. Right about Hayami or Miata for Pete's sake. Makina Uchi, who? This is why I can't leave the lead story to you. Uh, I had a feeling you would say that. I really don't even know why I bother at all. Ipo Makino Uchi, you're the right weight for the featherweight class. All right, next up, Jason Ozma. Hmm. He's got a wiry physique. And he's very muscular. Asma falls within the weight limit. Good. Sure am looking forward to the fight. Nah, the same here. I never feel comfortable having my weight checked. Everybody glares at me. Huh? Are you Mako no Uchi? What? Uh, yes. Pleased to meet you. I hear you're a very strong fighter. I'm looking forward to rising to the challenge. Let's have a good fight, shall we? Huh? Well, yes, it's a pleasure to meet you. My name's Ippo. Ippo. Though that means one step forward. First step, second step, oh, well, <laughs> pleased to meet you. Yeah, is this embarrassing or what? I couldn't agree with you anymore. What was all that yes, yes malarkey? I'm sorry, it's just that so far all my opponents have been the stare you down kind of guys, and I was just surprised by the way he acted. Wow, despite the scary name, it seems Jason Ozma's a nice guy. All right, I'm gonna rise to the challenge too. As usual, the kid's awfully damn cheery. But we've never seen him any more relaxed than this, so look on the bright side, right? Hmm. He's in his best condition. The main thing to worry about is whether that intensive training has paid off. Thanks for dinner, Mom. So, Mom? Hmm? Can you come tomorrow and watch me? I'm sorry, but I don't feel like going all that way to watch you get punched. I just can't bring myself to go. I'll come when you're so strong that nobody will be able to hurt you. That'll never happen. Whether you win or lose, Ipo, please be careful not to hurt yourself. Here, dear. All right. I've got to dodge his hook and give him a short uppercut while he's still vulnerable. 
and that'll trigger a barrage of punches. That's what I'm aiming for. Now listen, I've heard that Makano Uchi is a typical infight. Therefore, it'll probably turn into an exchange of punches within close range. Ozma, your ability to focus is the key to victory. Yeah. Okay. Good. Mr. Makano Uchi, please get ready. Right. <laughs> Great. Let's go, kid. Right. Oh, finally. Ozma's turn's coming up. Just get a grip. There isn't any reason to worry, so calm down. Yeah, you're right, but his challenger, Ippo, has won both of his matches by KO. I'm thinking that this guy has got to be pretty strong. Oh, what? You know full well there can't be any rookie who's stronger than Ozma. That much talked about Ozma is up next, isn't he? Right. I hear he left a fighter from the Narima boxing gym too injured to compete in this tournament. Oh, really? That's right. They say that Makanouchi's punches are pretty good as well, but it looks like the kid had bad luck drawing a challenger. Hey, looks like those guys talking down there are talent scouts from some boxing gym. That Ozma guy sounds like he's pretty tough. <laughs> Why don't we just wait and see how tough he really is? It'll be fine. I will win. Hey, look! Epo's really gonna fight that guy? <laughs> huh? Check out Epo. He looks just like he's a real pro. Hey, what did you expect, you idiot? We're counting on you, Epo! Don't you lose in the first round! Huh? Well, well, he's getting in the fighting spirit. Fair fight. No punches below the belt, no headbutts. All right, now go to your corners. Let him control the pace. The first to make a move wins. Oh. So he was thinking the same thing. I'll keep attacking and create my own chances. This guy's got a lot of power. Whoa. That's the stuff. The kid's taking charge and dictating the pace of the match. Give him a big barrage of punches and don't give him a chance to counter. Damn, that kid is aggressive. Ozma, get away from that boy, you hear? Compose yourself. Regain your balance. Whoa! He's connected! 
Uh, is it working? <laughs> that little fool got hasty and threw a roundhouse. Uh, what have I done? Kid, look out, it's the right hook! We got it now! <laughs> no! He dodged it. That intensive training has really paid off. This time, it's my turn! Huh? What did I just see? He dodged me! That's unbelievable! How can he dodge from that position? <clears throat> An amazing hook! When it comes to sharpness, he's on par with Mr. Takamura! <clears throat> that air slicing sound is out of this world! i never seen an uppercut like that. Oh, he dodged my left hook, too. This time to the body. Man, that new kid is really something. He can really throw an uppercut, can he? Yeah, boy, if that hook connected to the body, he'd be toast. Wow, this is really getting exciting. None of your punches are connecting. Come on, Ozma, knock him out. Intense! Just look at them swapping those knockdown blows down there! Swapping those knockdown blows down there. <clears throat> He's fast. Double hook to the right. It's an awesome punch. And here comes his left. Oh, so fast. <clears throat> He's coming at me faster and faster. No chance to counter. It's almost beyond his ability to dodge those continuous blows. The fight is so close. Unless he can somehow cut through them, he's got no chance. Ah! Speed, technique. Ozma's one notch above in everything. Another double hook to the right? No, that was a triple! <sighs> that was a close call. The left! I don't have enough time! Whoa! Strong. One! Yeah, he did it! Did it. Did it. Two! Nepo! Stay down, stay down, stay down, stay down! Wait, don't be too hasty, kid! Four. Take a rest until the eight count! Five! That's it. Calm down. Calm down. I need to rest as long as I can. He's gonna stand up. He ducked slightly before that last hit. That certainly had to lessen the damage. Six! Seven! Eight! Are you all right? Can you continue? Uh -huh. That guy's tougher than he looks. There's plenty of time left. I won't let you get away. Phew! Boy, that kid's gonna give me a heart attack someday. Boy, Epo suffered considerable damage. It's not good. Look at that. Ozma's getting ready. He wants to finish off with a barrage of punches. The four-round match only allows you two knockdowns. I have to survive for the remaining time. Box! He's going down. He has incredible metal strength, but I think my punches are taking their toll. Here's the finishing blow. Oh, wow. That was a close call. Whoa! Out of desperation comes a counterpunch. Both fighters are damaged. Nope, they've actually traded shallow, ineffective blows. 
Huh? Ozma looks a little shaken up. I know they weren't perfect, but I hit him with my three best shots. It hurts. If I get attacked now, it's all over. He's hanging in there. If I jump in recklessly and start swinging, who knows what he'll do. Don't move. Stay right there. first round. I was so freaked out I could hardly watch. Yeah, that wore me out. Dad, burn it. He was so close to nailing him. It really looked like it was about to finish him. That guy Makarauchi is amazingly tough. Ah, saved by the bell. I'm so sorry. You worked so hard to help me practice, and I still couldn't dodge his hooks. Well, actually, you were doing pretty good. You really hung in there. That's not true. After all, I fell down. Listen, pal, Ozma's hook just happened to hit you first. If your uppercut somehow connected first, I'm positive that the flow of the match would have gone completely the other way. There was only a razor-thin difference between his offense and your defense. Use your power in the second round. Fight him with a blow-for-blow -blow strategy. But, Chief, his barrage of hooks is just way too fast for me. My ducking isn't good enough. I'll be caught eventually. I'll have to stop that barrage to even stand a chance of connecting with that guy. You idiot! You just showed everyone here that you're perfectly capable of doing that! <sighs> Counterpunching? Mm-hmm. Picture his face right after you punched him. Didn't you see how petrified he looked? <sighs> <sighs> That's how powerful and penetrating your punches really are to him. Have confidence. You gotta believe in yourself. <sighs> now, kid, you gotta stay away from Ozma's hook, because if he connects with you, it could be all over. But you can't be a boxer if you're afraid of the wrist. That's just part of the sport. Yes, sir. Makano Uchi's got an ace up his sleeve. So if you prolong the match, you never know when he's going to get a chance to throw his lucky punch. Lucky for us, he hasn't been able to dodge all the hooks you've been throwing at him. The next round is the key. Catch him quick with your barrage and then just finish him. All right, sir. Now go for it, son. Corner men out! Hey, kid. Uh, Even if you get punched, don't show it on your face, whatever you do. Keep telling yourself it has no effect on you, no matter how much it hurts. That's the key for fighting blows with blows. Yes, sir. This is it for you. Stay awake, Epo. He's going for a knockout. Look out! Ah, it's deja vu! Time for the barrage of punches. All right, this is it. I shouldn't avoid this hook. I have to stop it before the barrage begins. Stopped Ozma! Wow, Epo really threw a nice counterpunch. So what? That counterpunch was definitely a really rotten strategy. He took the full brunt of Ozma's hook. Ozma, knock Epo out! It didn't affect me. It didn't affect me. Gotta hang in there. This Epo kid can sure take a punch. <laughs> Poor kid. He needs nine lives to win a fight like this. It's tough on Epo, but Ozma's in the same condition. 
Sure, counting on your fighting spirit might be a primitive strategy. <laughs> but when you fight about like this against a better boxer, well, this just might be his best strategy. Ooh. Come on, brother. Come on. What a punch! <laughs> this match isn't gonna be decided on points. They're both going for a knockout. My money's on Epo. Now is the time, little buddy. Short range. It's within reach for both boxers. But a fighter could definitely be damaged if the punches connect at that distance. The same goes for both of us. That's why I'm not going to give up. I won't allow it to affect me. I'll make a stand and punch back. After all, this is the only place I can fight. This is my distance. Next round, test of endurance. 